and I got something like that's called a brandy a brandy Coretta, and uh, this shit tastes very much like a like a mocha frappuccino, but with alcohol in it. First time trying authentic Chicago pizza, so we'll give you our final verdict after we eat. Your mama know you're ugly. You your daddy son. Yo, first I hear the beat, then I kill my step. Hit on with no hips, slide to the left. Yo, I'll be the bankroll. That's how I'm feeling. Man, I always tell my mom. Hello everyone, again, I'm Jules, and I'm Molly. welcome back to another epic family, we're here in none other than the infamous Chi-Town, yes, so we're going to do some exploring, and hopefully, don't get the trouble. <laughs> right. Because of, we're not from here. Right. We're not from here, but we're going to have a good time. And over the next few days, you guys will see what we do. Right. And go explore. Right. So, tune in. We're good. We're yeah. going to be here for a while, so. Yeah, I think we're, we're here until Friday, but nonetheless, we're going to have fun. We're going to have a wild, dope time. If you're from another day in Amishi Gaming, remember that our anniversary is tomorrow yes. on Wednesday. Yeah, so be there or be square. For sure. So where this next first stop is Navy Pier. I've been once before, but only like a one-stop thing, but never really explored. So and looking forward to going back. This is uh, pretty much like my first time ever traveling, so I'm excited. <laughs> so until we get to Navy Pier, we shall get it on and pop in. So see you again. Yay. Alrighty, folks. Second stop is the world's largest Starbucks in Chi Town. Hell yeah, this shit is. It's it absolutely like fucking coffee. And I want to have some coffee. This right. is like a college student's dream is to be up in here. Oh, look at the fucking escalator. Oh, the escalator is steady and they turn. It is so beautiful in here. I, I absolutely love everything. Look at all this coffee. Like, look this at is, all this. This is just this mind is blowing. Mind blowing. Man. I wonder why she didn't want to go. Who knows? But this shit. But this is amazing. Holy like, fuck. no one's ever been in here. And well, nobody from Michigan has. Yeah, this is huge. But we're about to continue to explore more of this shit. Oh, I yeah. Know. I wonder if they make frappuccinos. They should. That's the largest garments here in the world. <laughs> what if they have, like, all the limited edition ones? Oh, like, what if they sell all those here? Oh, if they do, I should get one. Let's see. Let's see. I'm excited. Excited, man. So, we'll come back in a sec. We got to go order our shit. <laughs> we are at the, almost at the rooftop, but not really the rooftop of the Starbucks, large Starbucks in the world. Time. Yeah, I'm so blankly, <laughs> so blankly put it, but it's so beautiful, like, up here. Like, it's the scenery. Yeah, the windows, the the big little grinder the, down there. The coffee bean holder bean bean. Yeah. Like all this shit is just it's, beautiful. It's so exquisite. Like I crossed this off my bucket list. I wanted to come here ever since I was five years old. You were nice to see. I never had Starbucks since I've been in college. So fun. Hearing about this, I heard about it when I was maybe eighteen. And I'm twenty one now, so Let's just say dreams do come true, especially when you find out there, there's a bar at the top. Yeah. <laughs> For drinks, I got some wine with some uh, different color blends and some very dark fruits. And I got something like that's called a brandy, a brandy Coretta. And uh, this shit tastes very much like a, 
like a mocha frappuccino, but with alcohol in it. Can you take this? No alcohol, huh? I tell you, the first drink I had, the first drink I had was actually uh, an espresso martini, and the coffee smell was a bit too strong for me. This literally tastes like nothing but fucking coffee. And I kind of like it. So if you're a coffee drinker and you are an alcoholic, this is the drink for you because it's the best of both worlds. Exactly. Love it. Love this. Yeah, that's the drinks that we got. The first drinks we got, I just explained them, but like, the first drink was so bad. This one, I recommend. It's not too sweet. It's not too bitter. It's right in the middle where it should be. That's what it says. My first drink was like really, like, really sweet. It, it was like the secure, secure, box. a secure type drink. And you know, in honor of like, people in Japanese culture and stuff like that. And it was really fucking delicious. Yeah, I'd give my first one an 8 out of 10 if it wasn't so strong on the coffee. Uh, and I'd give this one a perfect 10 because it's the perfect wine. It's not too sweet or too bitter. It's right in the middle of where it should be. And I give this one a nine out of ten. It's really good. It's like more strong than coffee. You can't taste the liquor in it. So, you know, it sweeps up like this shit like that. That's yeah. <laughs> But we'll definitely hit y'all up with that. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> but we'll definitely hit you guys up with the next stop on our Chicago tour. It's actually going really well. I'm glad that we actually saved up and actually gone here. Now it's off my bucket list for good. Um, might come back here. Not even gonna lie to you. Might come back here next summer. Actually, we might. We should probably come back tomorrow. And to, to get like and something light and then go to the beer. Oh yeah. <laughs> like no, go to the come here, then go to the beer. Then go to the beer. Then go to the beer. Yeah, for the nighttime cruise. Ooh, it's about to be fun. So we'll see you at those epic events later. Yeah. So see you then. See you then. Ow. Well, we're at the first. Well second location. It's called Buckingham Memorial Fountain at Grant Park. And it's very, very windy down here. And they don't call it the windy city. Right? Oh, it could be sure. Well, we're gonna go ride around, see what's going on. Yeah, so we'll see you guys at the next, uh, at the next location, so. Yeah. For sure.
Giordano's Pizza. I hope I pronounced that right. <laughs> so, I will we'll show you the pizza we actually got. We got a meat and more meat pizza. Meat, meat, and more meat. Where does the meat look it's actually a nice place. Uh, first time trying authentic Chicago pizza. So we'll give you our final verdict after we eat. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, seriously. Yeah.